Someone in my stream yesterday was like, Kayla, you should build a house using only objects you hate. And at first I was like, oh my god, absolutely not. Why do you want me to suffer? What did I ever do to you? And then I thought more about it and I was like, wait, content. <laughs> and so today we're gonna make a Sims house using exclusively my least favorite objects. Sounds like a dumb concept, but hear me out. It's gonna be awful. <laughs> like what, like the worst house possible. And I think that's funny. At first I was gonna build it in like Forgotten Hollow, the vampire world because, you know, awful, or Strangerville because I hate that world, but but really I just hate those packs. <laughs> the worlds are kind of cool, like Strangerville's a beautiful world. A world I actually hate is Del Sol Valley. I never build here, the lighting is awful all the time, it's, it's just bad, you know? And so I was thinking, well why don't we build a house here? <laughs> On Inner Circle, this world had so much potential and they just threw it away. But it's fine. I'm okay. It's fine. Look at the lighting on this lot. Why is it so bad all the time? Ideally, I like to build on lots that have like the sun shining directly at them in the afternoon because they have the best lighting for building. You don't want shadows in the front of your house. Even the back of this house doesn't have good lighting. Del Sol Valley just has bad lighting <laughs> everywhere. It's no fun to build in and it sucks because the world is kind of cool. Like, this neighborhood is genuinely awesome. Like, I, I love this concept. The lighting, you can't build here because it's just bad. And it's a 40 by 30 lot. My god, okay. Well, <laughs> I'm thinking it needs to be a two bedroom house. Because then we can have like, the, the worst adult furniture and the worst kids furniture, right? I don't even know what size of a house to make, okay. Start with the box, kids. And what style of house? Oh, we should base it on the windows. What are my least favorite windows? Okay, hang on, we gotta rethink this. I'm gonna make a wall with all the worst windows. It should have tall wall height too, huh? Oh god. <laughs> Honestly, this door, good potential. Don't like how it looks though. And nothing nice matches it. <laughs> I hate to say this, and I wish it wasn't the case, but you guys, the jungle adventure windows and the Sulani ones, the island living ones, I hate these windows. I don't like how small they are. I don't like how they're open. I don't like the sizing. I, do, I don't like them. <laughs> the same goes with Island Living. Like, I, I just wish that these weren't the way they were. Like, I wish we had a good single tile window that isn't this one. I think they're a fun stylistic choice, but I just, I think it was a missed opportunity. Like, I like this window. I just wish it wasn't the only good window. I mean, the glass ones are great, but like, I mean, why is that the only good single tile? Like, I just, I don't know. I, I think it was a missed opportunity and so I think I'm gonna pick these windows. I just, I don't like how they're open. I'm sorry. <laughs> so if we're gonna build a, okay. This is gonna be awful. I'm really sorry, you guys. That is the worst door in the game. I mean, why, are you seeing this? Maybe I, maybe I take back my opinion about this um, jungle adventure vibe. Maybe we pick this vibe as the worst vibe in the game. <laughs> No, the lighting is orange on the inside. <laughs> Why? Uh, yep, that's awful. Okay. <laughs> See, I would like it to actually look kind of okay. <laughs> I, I know it's not gonna look good, but I would like it to look all right, you know, and I, I don't think it will <laughs> But I can try right? I think one of the worst parts is how all the black tones aren't the same like these are darker than this It's just so annoying. Okay. I also despise this giant trim. I think it's so weird. <laughs> okay. I wanna apologize in advance for what I have to do here today. I always hated this like hexagon paneled one. It's not, it's growing on me in this context, I think, but like that metal roof. Oh, <laughs> this metal roof in the green color. It makes me wanna cry. Do you know what the worst part is? I think it's the fact that like this, this door is orange on the inside. So this house is gonna be orange and green. <laughs> Oh. All right, I got this. <laughs> we'll have a kitchen here, dining room here, some sort of sitting area, desk area, living room, and then two bedrooms? Yeah, okay, sure. <laughs> I know you don't care about the floor plan that much right now. Oh god, okay, so I think one of the worst items, and I'm dead serious, is this tile. And so for that reason, I'm going to put it in the kitchen. Should we put it in the whole house? <laughs> I was thinking about using this bowling night stuff one in the bathroom too. Get some carpet in the kids room, some nice um, orange toned wood in the master bedroom. Honestly, maybe we could get that in the dining room too. <laughs> Ew. I always despise this light from Dine Out. God, I hated it so much. <laughs> I'll put it in the bathroom. This stupid alien lamp can go in the kids room. <laughs> right in the center of that ceiling. Okay. <laughs> 
feel like some bugs could be nice on the wall. I'm gonna be real, this chandelier is hideous, as is much of the stuff from Get Famous. So, um, you know, consider yourselves warned, but I'm putting that in the master. It can stay in that color too. <laughs> Thinking something like this vampire chandelier for the living room. Oh wow, yeah. Or potentially this. No, this is more hideous. I'm sorry, I can't. We can use both. Wait, that can go in the kitchen. <laughs> wow. Perfect. Speaking of kitchens, this may be an unpopular opinion, but my god are the upper cabinets <laughs> from Cool Kitchen Stuff hideous. Why do they have to all be frosted? I'm serious. What In what world does that make sense? That you have exclusively frosted cabinets? Like, who... who only has frosted cabinets? I don't understand. This fridge is horrible. <laughs> I hate this one. I hate it so much. I think my biggest issue with it is the fact that like the handle on it is white so there's no contrast. I cannot express to you how much it bothers me. I know it's not a big deal, but oh you guys, it really, it really gets on my nerves. I feel really sad right now. <laughs> I hate to say it, but I think we might be getting glass doors into all the bedrooms. <laughs> Oh god, okay. I'm gonna stick the doors in the corner. Oh wow, how nice is that? I think you knew what I would pick. This tile is revolting. <laughs> yeah, okay. I still want it to look decent, but I, <laughs> I feel like we've thrown that out the window. This bat wallpaper makes me want to cry. Should I put it in the living room? Oh, in red. Wow. Oh no, I can get behind that. We have a few contenders here for worst sofa. I think it, it might be this one though. <laughs> I think, um, at least I think with these two, there's kind of a clear style and, and time and place for them. But this thing? Is there a time and place for this? I'm- I don't think so. I know you guys know I hate Realm of Magic, but my god, this- I don't- I cannot get behind this. I never could with the crystals in it. I think this whole thing is so weird. This whole fireplace, the shape of it, the- the- it just- I, there is so much potential. Like, I wish it were more square on the bottom. And, and like it was like a feature piece on the top. I don't know. There's just something about it that like bugs me. <laughs> oh, orange. <laughs> Guys, I swear I wanted to try. <laughs> I'm serious. I was really gonna try. <laughs> we can change the wallpaper. It's okay. Maybe like an orange brick. Oh god, that. Mm. Yep. Oh, you know. Okay, no, this is fine. I cannot get behind this like sunsetty wallpaper. I never liked it. I don't understand it. I think it's fine for like some certain kids rooms. <laughs> But some of the colors on it are so much. Maybe it's just this house that's so much. <laughs> There's fish bones. I'm sorry, I really, I really didn't mean it when I said I was gonna try. <laughs> that's so funny. Like, what is this plant too, you know? Like this kind of stuff, like what is that? Honestly, that clown painting kind of ties it together. It kind of works. And I'm sorry, but this tapestry, I just, I cannot <laughs> get behind it. I think the the things are all just too colorful for me in most of the builds that I do. It kinda works in here though. I have always hated this bookcase. I think- I don't know why. <laughs> I think it's just because it needs to be against a wall and it doesn't by default place like in the corner like that and it bugs me. It's not even that bad of a bookcase. I just have always had this like thing against it so I never use it. <laughs> this table is stupid. This computer is so ugly in so many ways. <laughs> Along with this chair. <laughs> I wish that I could properly express to you how much I dislike this bathtub. I don't know what it is. It's just, it, it bugs me. <laughs> and you know what bugs me more? Pedestal sinks. In particular, this one. What a waste of space. Imagine, you could have a cabinet underneath this sink in real life, but no. No, you just want to have a weird, chunky pedestal sink with no storage and nowhere to put anything. It's so stupid. I hate this sink. <laughs> and the tiny living mirror that is somehow way too high for anything ever. And honestly, I like the matching toilet from Cats and Dogs. And the bathroom set is fine, right? But it's just the bathtub is so obnoxious. <laughs> there we go. That works. <laughs> this is sad. I wanted it to be good. I just... It's just becoming fuel for my rage. I swear, I was gonna try. I really was. I have always hated this table because I, it just bugs me that the wood colors you want, 
you're not going to get a nice colored like runner on it. No matter what, you just, it won't, nothing's going to match the way you want it to. <laughs> you know what? I have literally never used this fitness stuff chair ever in my life. That's kind of cute. Okay, you're fine. You're safe. This might be unpopular, but these little city living chairs, I hate them. And a close second is this one from Dine Out. It just, it looks so like, I want to say squidgy. Like when you, you, I can just picture sitting in this and like your legs getting stuck to it. And, and I just, ugh, it seems so uncomfortable and gross to me. And I don't, I don't like this chair. Maybe I'll use that one. Oh, then I can make it red. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I changed my mind. <laughs> I thought about it more and now I want this one instead. <laughs> gonna bring tears to my eyes. I'm serious you guys, I swear I tried. I was thinking we could pick something fancy for the dining room walls, like this. Is that too obnoxious? It's too obnoxious. Oh, these get to work chairs fill me with rage. Oh, <laughs> it just, I think part of it is the fact that it's like a tease because you want to be able to use these kind of things. Like these look like they could be pieces that you could use to form some sort of sectional sofa. Like I wish I could have one that's just one, but then attach another one and then it would keep growing and then make a long sofa. Kind of like what this should be, the ones they gave us with university, but we are still yet to have sectionals in this game. And these ones, they fill me with rage, <laughs> as does this stupid poof table that's not a chair, it's just a table. Why? Why did, Why would you do that? That doesn't make any sense. And this little tiny lamp that also doesn't make any sense. I'm kind of getting angry now. <laughs> I wish we had more like, like if this lamp was, is, was somewhere in between the size that it is now and the size it is sized up, I think it just needs to be a little bit bigger. It's nice to have some tiny lamps, but I feel like I shouldn't have only tiny lamps that are cute for desks. This painting always bugged me. I think because I wish that it had a few better colors, but like this color swatch, I don't know why. It just, I think, I think I wish it was in frames. I think I like it. I think it's a cool modern looking painting. I just have a hard time using it most of the time. And I always wish it was in frames. I think it would be cool if, if it wasn't just canvases like this, like if they were each a framed canvas, but they were still like three separate pieces. I don't know. Or if it was like three different kind of sunflower images, sort of like, wait, I think what I'm asking for is like how Tiny Living has three different leaves. If there was like three different sunflowers, <laughs> I would like that better. And then I could place the canvases myself instead of them being, you know what I mean? Okay, cool. Glad to hear it. The tiny living lamp makes the list because I wish that the shade wasn't always so dark, that it had better wood swatches, and also that this thing was actually a table. <laughs> I don't understand why it doesn't let you slot anything onto that shelf because it makes so much sense, but whatever. <laughs> oh no. I will never ever be able to get behind this bed, by the way. <laughs> Honestly, most of the things that come with vintage glamour, I cannot get behind, but even worse, is this weird pedestal side table. Or no, this one. Oh, it's the tufted one. It's way too big for starters. Oh, look at that. <laughs> this plant is always too big. Even when you size it down, it's always too big. Look, I sized it down and it's still too big. Look at this, it's usually this big. Oh, I'm sorry. This lamp just filled me with so much rage. I'm putting it next to the couch. Oh, I, oh my God, I used to hate this lamp when they first made it. I don't know what it was about it. I, j oh, th yeah, no, I don't like that lamp. <laughs> and this thing, oh, I hate this thing. That could be a really cute, cute little floral vase thing. Why does it have to light up? Absolutely stunning. I know we've had this discussion a million times. My First Pet Stuff, it's not original to hate on it, but you guys, the kids' furniture in My First Pet Stuff is so chunky and weird. I will never understand why they did it this way. It's cats and dogs too. The cats and dogs, it's like, it's so, again, it's so chunky <laughs> for some reason. It just looks so big. <laughs> I always hated decals for walls too. I don't know why, I just don't like them. <laughs> I never use them in my Sims builds. I feel like I'm being so negative right now. I don't actually care that much. It's all a joke, okay? <laughs> I promise. I still despise this orange brick. It really, it hurts me deeply. <laughs> I don't know what it is. I've always hated like orange toned bricks and woods. It just, ugh. Which is why this flooring is so gross to me. <gasps> this one's worse. Oh, wow. These dine out columns that have lights on the bottom. <laughs> I never use these. How about a green fence to like, you know, tie in the green roof? <laughs> I, I swear I'm trying, okay? I know it might not look like it, but I am. I always hated this table. They just added it, but I hated this table because it has the tablecloth on it. I'm sorry. I really did try. I don't even know where to begin with landscaping. I genuinely, I have no clue. That, I can sufficiently say that I hate that. Yeah, 
No, so that must be good. <laughs> Maybe you just can't grow anything but bananas here. And so no other plants are on this lot. <laughs> How about that? Oh, I just went inside. Oh, guys, shield your eyes. <laughs> I feel so disappointed. I really was gonna try. I feel like I did try. <laughs> but I was like, I can make a house look cool with only bad items that I don't like. But, um, you know, in hindsight, I don't think I can make a house look cool with just the bad items that I don't like. I don't like them for a reason. <laughs> and I especially don't like them together because this is horrible and, and honestly, I want to look away. I would love to see you guys try and do this. <laughs> the Sims 4 bad house challenge. I'm, I'm sorry for wasting your time. Um, you shouldn't have watched this. I don't know what to tell you. I, <laughs> but thank you for sticking around with me as we suffered through this together. I think on that note, I am gonna go. <laughs> so please make sure to leave a like and comment and subscribe and do all those funny tube things. And in case you guys didn't know, I have new video- I make new videos every single day. <laughs> and so I will see you all tomorrow. Bye everybody. If you have any other cool build challenge ideas, let me know in the comments down below because I would greatly appreciate your suggestions. Please make me suffer.